Let me ask you a question that most men think about, but rarely say out loud. What actually happens if you ejaculate every single day? Is it healthy? Is it harmful? Could it boost your performance or secretly drain your energy over time? If you've ever wondered about this, you're not alone. I hear this question all the time in my clinic from men of all ages. It's one of those topics that lives in the shadows, half whispers, myths, even guilt. And yet, it's central to men's health, relationships, and confidence. Today, we're breaking that silence. I'm Dr. Narita, a board-certified urologist with over 12 years of experience helping men take charge of their sexual and overall health. And in this video, I'm going to give you the full picture, the five surprising benefits of ejaculating daily, the five potential drawbacks you need to watch out for, and most importantly, how to know what's right for your body, your goals, and your health. By the end, you'll feel confident, informed, and clear, without shame, without guesswork. But first, Tell me in the comments, where are you watching from today? I love seeing this community grow around the world. And while you're down there, hit that like button and subscribe. Because each week we talk honestly about men's health topics that most people avoid. Now, let's get into it. Let's clear up the biggest misconception right away. There is no universal answer. Ejaculating daily isn't automatically good and it isn't automatically bad. It depends on why you're doing it, how you're doing it, and what impact it's having on your body and mind. Some men thrive on a daily release. Better sleep, less stress, more confidence. Others may find that it dulls their desire, drains their energy, or even creates performance issues over time. So the truth isn't black and white, it's about context, your biology, your habits, and your life stage. Now, let me reassure you, if you felt unsure about this, it's not because you're ignorant. Most men were never taught how their bodies truly work when it comes to sexual health. That's why I've made it my mission after 12 years as a urologist to break down complex science into simple, practical advice you can use every day. So think of this conversation as doctor to friend. My job is to help you understand what's happening in your body so you can make informed choices, not live by myths or fear. And with that, let's explore the five surprising benefits of ejaculating every day followed by the five important drawbacks you should know about. Benefit number one, pleasure hormones and mood regulation. Ever notice how relaxed you feel afterward? That's not your imagination. When you ejaculate, your brain releases a powerful cocktail of chemicals, endorphins, your body's natural painkillers, dopamine, the reward chemical that motivates and energizes, Oxytocin, the bonding hormone that builds connection and trust. Serotonin, the stabilizer that keeps your mood even. Biologically, this release resets your nervous system. Emotionally, it can calm anxiety, lighten your mood, and help you feel more grounded. Practically, that means less tension snapping at loved ones, less bottled up stress, and more day-to-day -day resilience. Daily release becomes like a natural reset button, not a cure-all, but a gentle, consistent support for mental health. Benefit number two, better sleep quality. Have you ever noticed feeling heavy-eyed after sex or masturbation? That's because of prolactin, a hormone that promotes relaxation and sleep. Add that to the stress-reducing endorphins and oxytocin, and you've got a built-in sleep aid. For men who struggle with racing thoughts, stress, or even mild insomnia, this can mean falling asleep faster and staying asleep longer. Biologically, it's about hormones. Emotionally, it's about relief from restless nights. Practically, it means better recovery, sharper focus, and more energy the next day. Benefit number three, improved blood flow and circulation. Orgasm isn't just a brain event, it's full body exercise. During arousal, your blood vessels dilate, your heart rate increases, and circulation ramps up everywhere. This vasodilation helps deliver oxygen and nutrients to your muscles, brain, and skin. Biologically, it's like a mini workout for your vascular system. Emotionally, it boosts confidence by improving erection quality. Practically, it helps keep your cardiovascular system responsive, an often overlooked piece of men's health. Benefit number four, lower risk of prostate cancer. This is one of the most compelling findings. A major Harvard study following over 30,000 men for nearly 20 years found that men who ejaculated 21 times or more per month had a lower risk of prostate cancer. Why? The theory is that ejaculation helps flush out the prostate, removing old cells, inflammatory agents, and other buildups that could otherwise increase cancer risk. 
Biologically, it's a natural cleansing process. Emotionally, it offers reassurance about one of men's biggest health fears. Practically, it means sexual activity may play a role in protecting your prostate, though of course, it's not a substitute for regular checkups. Benefit number five, immune system support. Here's a bonus you may not have expected. Studies show that sexual arousal and orgasm can boost levels of IgA, immunoglobulin A, one of your body's first-line defenses against viruses and bacteria. Combine that with lower stress, which itself strengthens immunity, and you get subtle but real immune support. Biologically, that's a stronger shield. Emotionally, that's peace of mind. Practically, it's another reason sexual health fits into overall wellness. Now, we have to be honest. Daily ejaculation isn't risk-free. For some men, it backfires. Here are the five biggest drawbacks. Drawback number one, compulsive behavior. There's a huge difference between a healthy habit and an unhealthy compulsion. If you're choosing daily ejaculation consciously for pleasure, stress relief, or intimacy, that's one thing. But if you feel controlled by the urge, if it starts interfering with work, relationships, or focus, then it's veering into compulsive territory. Biologically, compulsive patterns can rewire your reward system. Emotionally, they create guilt and shame. Practically, they drain time, focus, and even intimacy with partners. The key question to ask yourself, am I choosing this or is it choosing me? Drawback number two, using it as an emotional crutch. We all face stress, boredom, loneliness, or sadness. But if ejaculation becomes your only coping tool, it may be masking deeper emotional needs. Biologically, it creates a dependency on one pathway for relief. Emotionally, it can prevent real healing. Practically, it keeps men from building healthier outlets. Exercise, journaling, connection, therapy. Ejaculation should be one tool, not the only tool. Drawback number three, lower sperm count if trying to conceive. If you're not trying to have kids, this isn't a concern, but if you are, daily ejaculation can lower sperm concentration. Biologically, sperm need time to replenish, usually 48 to 72 hours. Emotionally, this can create stress for couples struggling with fertility. Practically, spacing out ejaculations every two to three days during conception efforts may improve chances. It's not about abstinence, it's about strategy. Drawback number four, reduced sensitivity or desire. Paradoxically, too much of a good thing can blunt your reward system. Daily ejaculation, especially when rushed or repetitive, can lower sensitivity or reduce spontaneous desire. Biologically, your brain adapts, dampening dopamine's punch. Emotionally, it can create a flat, unmotivated feeling. Practically, you may notice less arousal with your partner. Short breaks, even just a few days, can reset sensitivity and restore spark. Drawback number five, performance issues, if rushed. If daily ejaculation happens through quick, hurried stimulation, your body learns speed. Over time, this can condition premature ejaculation or performance anxiety with a partner. Biologically, your nervous system adapts to sprint mode. Emotionally, it creates frustration for both partners. Practically, it undermines confidence in the bedroom. The fix? Slow down. Practice edging, breath control, or mindful stimulation. Train your body for rhythm, not just release. So, what's the bottom line? Daily ejaculation isn't inherently good or bad. The key is to ask, why am I doing this? Stress relief, pleasure, intimacy, or compulsion? How is it affecting me? Am I sleeping better, feeling confident, or noticing fatigue, flatness, or guilt? Does it fit my goals? If I'm trying to conceive, do I need to adjust frequency? Practical tips. Pay attention to your body. Track energy, mood, libido. Experiment. Try daily. Try spacing out. See what feels best. Balance. Make sexual release one tool in a larger wellness toolkit. Communicate with your partner, if you have one. Never ignore changes in erection quality, pain, or prostate health. Those deserve medical evaluation. If you felt shame, confusion, or even fear around this topic, you're not alone. Sexual health is part of human health. It doesn't make you weak, weird, or broken to ask these questions. In fact, it makes you wise. Because the more you understand your body, the more freedom and dignity you gain in your daily life. So here's the truth. 
Ejaculating every day can be perfectly healthy, or it can signal habits that need a little balance. It's not about rules. It's about self-awareness. And here's the most empowering part. You have the power to adjust. Small changes, whether adding a break, slowing down, or using intimacy as connection instead of escape, can give you more energy, confidence, and control. Age is not the end of vitality. Whether you're 30, 50, or 70, your body can adapt, your health can improve, and your confidence can grow. So keep learning, keep listening to your body, and keep building the kind of life that gives you comfort, freedom, and strength. I am Dr. Narita. Thank you for spending this time with me. If you found this video helpful, give it a like, subscribe for more men's health content each week, and share your thoughts in the comments. I read them all, and this community means a lot to me. And remember, your body is worth understanding, your health is worth protecting, and your vitality is worth fighting for. Take care of yourself. You deserve it.